Hi, in this video I will show you how to clone a computer over network with Clonezilla. A little reminder, the previous video was to clone a local disk to a local disk, you can find it at the top, it's the same principle to clone one disk to another, but this time we will clone through the network. So you need a source computer and a destination computer. I have two laptops HP Omen, they are pre-installed with Windows 10. I need Ubuntu 2004 installed. For that, I will prepare a disk of the source laptop and have it cloned on the other laptop. This allows us to save time for each install and especially not do the same task several times. So, I prepared the laptop, I installed Ubuntu 2004 and tools like Java, Chrome, Visual Studio Code, etc. Afterward, I connected the two laptops to the same network on the router with the cable, since for Wi-Fi you need a manual configuration on Clonezilla. In the end, I plugged a bootable USB with Clonezilla live on each laptop. Let's begin by boot on Clonezilla live on the source laptop. I use multi-bootable USB from ISO with Ventoy, you can watch the video on top. Click enter. Choose the language. I will change my keyboard layout since he is a Zerti. Click on Start Clonezilla. You can see Clonezilla can clone device to the image or to device, you can find this video at the top. Also, you can cloning with the Clonezilla server for several cloning at the same time. Click on the remote source. Choose the expert mode, as the name suggests is for expert users. Otherwise, I will suggest beginner mode for the default option, it is easier. Now choose disk to remote disk, for cloning the entire disk. Otherwise, you can clone just a partition for that choose the second option. Choose the mode to set up the network, I will choose DHCP mode. You can see the IP address is 192.168.200.3, for the source laptop. Choose local disk as source. Now keep the default option, and press enter. Choose the network pipe program when cloning over network. We choose the default one netcat. Choose the program for compressed data before sending to destination. We choose the default one ZSTD. ZSTD is a fast lossless compression algorithm, it's used by Facebook to compress and decompress data. Now keep the default option, and press enter. Keep the default option, and press enter. Press enter to continue. Now the source laptop is ready and waiting for the destination laptop to connect. We are going to prepare the destination laptop. Click enter. Choose the language. Click on Start Clonezilla. Click on Remote Dest.
Choose DHCP mode. Now put the IP address of the source laptop 192.168.200.3. Choose Restore Disk. Choose Local Disk as the destination. Now press Enters to continue. To confirm tap yes. Tap yes again. The cloning will be started. Once cloning is complete choose reboot and tests the two laptops. You can see that Ubuntu started without problems. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think of this video in the comment. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on my future videos.